Hello viewers, this is a tutorial on how to automate unfriend on Facebook using Socinator. Let's start with the Accounts Manager screen from where we can navigate to configure the accounts. To do that, right-click on your Facebook account and hit Go to Tools. It will take you to the Account Configuration screen. You can also see the available activities which can be automated on Facebook through Socinator. Let's click Unfriend. This is very useful as it makes it faster and easier to unfriend a number of Facebook users within a period of time while narrowing them down in the process. There are several configuration categories for the unfriend activity. Let's start with unfriend source. Here you can narrow down the users you want to unfriend. People added by software, so people added by Socinator. Next is people added outside software, so people you added yourself. Next is custom users list, so if you click this one, you can specify the users you want to unfriend. So let's just type their name here, for example, name. You may clear using the clear all button. You may also import from CSV or text file by clicking this button. Select the right file and click open. When you're done, click the save button over here. Finally, you can unfriend mutual friends if you want to. Next, we have source filter. So requests should have been sent before. You can specify the number of days and hours. Next, we have job configuration. So this allows us to choose the speed at which an account should unfriend users. We have already created a few activity speed configurations which we can use, like slow with an average daily activities of 25, medium with 41, fast with 66, or super fast with 125. Super fast is not recommended for new or real accounts. If you want to define your own speed settings, click advanced settings. Delay between each operation is the number of seconds between each Facebook user is unfriended. Delay between jobs is the number of minutes the software should pause after unfriending the number of Facebook users you set in number of unfriended per job. Number of unfriended per job will allow you to specify the number of Facebook users you want to unfriend per job or per cycle. You may also specify the number of Facebook users to unfriend per hour, per day, and per week. Click this box if you want to increase each day with a specific number until it reaches another specific number of max unfriends per day. You can also create a daily schedule under day of the week when to operate. This is very useful if you want to keep unfriending Facebook users even when you're asleep or busy doing other things. If you don't want to operate on Monday, click the trash bin button under Monday and it's gone. You can add multiple time frames in one day. Simply click the day you want to configure, Monday for example, provide the start and end time, let's say 12 a.m. to 1.59 a.m. and click add interval and it's added. Let's add another one, let's say 2 a.m. to 11.59 p.m., click add interval so as you can see, we can have several schedules in one day. You may save these time settings by clicking Create Favorite. Let's call it Facebook Unfriend, for example, and click Save. We can then open it by clicking Select Favorite Time and choosing Facebook Unfriend. The next tool is User Filters. This allows us to filter the users we want to unfriend on Facebook. For example, we can choose to unfriend either male or female users. For location, you can specify where the user should live. So enter the location here. You may edit or clear using the clear all button and it's gone. You may also import from CSV or text file by clicking this button, select the right file and click open. When you're done, click the save button over here. Finally, we can manage whitelist and blacklist. So if you click Manage Whitelist and Blacklist, you have the option to choose either Private Whitelist or Group Whitelist. So Private Whitelist belongs to a specific Facebook account. Group Whitelist is shared between all the accounts you add. Next, you also have the option to add to Blacklist after unfriending them. So Blacklisted users are the Facebook profiles you do not want Socinator to interact with. You can add to either a private blacklist, which is actually a blacklist that belongs to a specific Facebook account, or a group blacklist, which is shared between all the accounts you add. 
So when you're satisfied with all the configurations and are ready to start unfriending Facebook users, let's scroll up and hit the save button, success, and click the status button to make it active. Now that it's active, let me show you another option in automating unfriend on Facebook using Socinator. This one allows us to create campaigns, which is perfect for multiple accounts. To start, let's go to the upper right corner of the app and click the social drop-down button and select Facebook. This will bring us to the accounts tab. Let's switch to grow friends tab and select unfriend on the left side of the app. Here we can name our campaign. Let's call it Facebook unfriend. For unfriend source, let's unfriend people added by software or Socinator. For job configuration, an average daily activities of 25 should be okay, so let's select slow. For user filters, let's choose both genders. For manage whitelist and blacklist, let's add to blacklist after unfriend to a group blacklist. When you're ready, let's click the blue button, select account or accounts. In this part, you can select multiple Facebook accounts. Since we only have one account right now, let's go with that by checking the box and click save. After saving, let's click the red button, create campaign. If you want to proceed, click the box of the account and click save. This will automatically bring us to the campaigns tab where you can see that we have successfully created our Facebook unfriend campaign. Click the status button to pause the campaign and the action button over here will allow us to edit, duplicate, or delete the campaign. And that's it for this tutorial. I hope you learned a lot and thank you so much for watching.